USB. It stands for Universal Serial Bus, so you would think that it would be, well, universal, right? You'd be wrong. I'm Tom Brandt at PCMag.com, and USB ports actually come in many different flavors. Some are different sizes. Some can transfer data faster than others. Others can charge devices even when the computer is turned off. And some even double as Thunderbolt ports. So how do you know which of the supposedly universal serial buses you're supposed to use? Begin by looking at the shape of the plug. The one you're likely familiar with from your smartphone charger is a narrow rectangle known as USB Type A. It's been around for decades, and on a PC, you might use it to plug in peripherals like keyboards, scanners, printers. A newer Type C plug is smaller and has curved sides. Some newer phones, tablets, and PCs use it for charging since it delivers more electrical current. Next, look for the plug's color. A blue Type A plug indicates USB 3.0 speeds, which are roughly five times faster than USB 2.0. Many PCs have both USB 3.0 slots and USB 2.0 slots, so plug faster devices like hard drives into the USB 3.0 ports and save the USB 2.0 ones for slower things like keyboards and mice. Finally, check the labels. Some PCs use the SS label for super speed instead of or in addition to the blue color. There are also Thunderbolt icons next to some USB Type-C ports, but not others. Thunderbolt means speeds up to eight times faster than USB 3.0. And finally, if you see a battery icon, that typically means that the port can deliver a charge to the laptop or an external device. Don't forget to like and subscribe and visit PCMag.com. Now that you know all about USB ports, don't be afraid to use them.